stand in front of the main entrance door to your house, to your shop or your office and blow these three items into your shop, office or house. Let's see what happens. Mix these three dried items together in your left palm, blow it inside your shop, blow it inside your house or your office and wash money flows to you like never before. Wash customers begin to rush whatever you are selling. By God's grace, in today's video, I want to give you a spiritual clue, a spiritual direction of combination of three items that you should blow in into your office, into your shop, or into your house, especially as the month is still young, and watch how you will not lack money, and money will begin to pursue you in this month instead of you pursuing money. But this does not rule out the fact that you should be committed in doing something. Let me tell you one truth. God is not a magician. He will not bless you more than the circle of your influence, more than that business, from that business you are doing or from that particular work. And that is actually why the Bible said something that he will bless us from our storehouse. Early this year, I made a video reminding you that you should at least have four streams of income. Reason is this, that when God created the Garden of Eden, he put four different streams supplying water to that garden. And believe me, what, wherever you are is your own garden of Eden, and you need four streams in order to make it to survive. Gone are days that people survive by salary alone. God never promised us that he will bless us by salary. Salary is just where you can get your seed money to enter into the main business or the main thing that God wants you to do. So if you are not into serious business, you are because it's in our storehouse that God say you bless us. So please use this period and pray unto the Almighty God to direct you on the business you will do to reveal it to you. I've made a series of videos in this channel on how to get any secret from Almighty God using onions, using salt and water, using different means, even through your dreams, up through your third eye, and so on and so forth using even candle. So you can use any of this to help pray to Almighty God to give you perfect direction so that you will be gainfully employed in something. Because that is one of the ways that when you do this type of spiritual work, I'm telling you now, you will get massive abundance. And also, I am not ruling out the fact that God can also raise people to touch you, but I'm giving you options that will make you to manifest better so if only you can follow me to the end of today's video i will tell you these three items that you need to blow in into your home within these first to seven days of this moon try to do this and believe me you will not lack money this particular month so before then please give this video a thumbs up as you do so may god bless you so welcome once again to jenny action tv in this particular channel i'll discuss three important variables which actually has safety and spirituality. Believe me, if you can understand and apply this trick correctly in your life, the sky will not be your limit, but it becomes your starting point. If this is the very first time you're landing in this channel, you are highly welcome. Please do well to hit the red subscribe button and the bell notification so that YouTube will always notify you once I upload a new video. For my returning subscribers, I love you so much. Thank you for always stopping by. For my new timers, if you are searching for any video, all you need to do is go to the search button in YouTube, type Jenny Action TV, slide the keyword of the video you are looking for. For example, money. You get the videos I made in the past about money, you watch and get some values. So without wasting your time, let's delve into the video of today. Stand in front of your, your house, your office, or your shop and blow these three items in. Let's see what happens. What are these three items you need to blow in? Number one, cinnamon. If you know the extreme energy possessed by cinnamon, my dear, every morning you will blow it in into your house before leaving. You will not allow cinnamon not to be part of what will go out with you in your bag. So when you have gotten your cinnamon powder, the next thing you actually need is scent leaf. But this time around, you need to dry it. Let me tell you, do you know that there are significant things that fresh leaf cannot do for you but dry leaf does it for example some people when i post recipe they will be asking me if they will use dry leaf 
are you aware that the bay leaf we are using dry here is a fresh leaf to other people? Dry leaf possess enormous benefits as well as fresh leaf. So when you get scent leaf or basil leaf, dry it very well, or mint leaf, but preferable scent leaf, dry it very well and blend it, or you can even use hand to pieces it. So anytime you can get that, you dry and get enough quantity is best. So when you have done it, you store it in a container like this. Then the third thing you need is actually ginger. So when you have also dry, you can get ginger lump like this, slice it so that it will dry quickly. You grind it and store. If you cannot get undiluted or mixed one, same thing is applicable to cinnamon. You need to get a cinnamon stick enough blend it and store it if you cannot get undiluted ones because because of quest for wealth people are doing a lot of things and when you use fake items to do your spiritual work believe me the manifestation is less if you want powerful manifestation you need to use original item you can be suffering from headache and go and buy a kind of fake paracetamol and want to get a result you will not get that result so that is the exact thing that happens to spiritual material so when you have dried blend this particular scent leaf and then you get dried blended uh, ginger and then blended cinnamon mix the three together in your left palm the left palm is our spiritual palm that is why most of the times whatever you carry in the palm to pray is best you carry it in the left palm. One that will teach you the mystery and enhance. That is why the Bible will always say, Blessed is the Lord who teaches our hands to fight and our fingers to do battle. And the same Bible say, I will bless the work of your hands. That is why I tell you stop checking people because every energy coming to your body is summarizing your palm, summarizing this your hand. Whatever you touch and mingle with with your hands have a lot of vibration in your life. Some people will say it is not easy. I can't do with your shaking. Now, if you can't do with your shaking, depending on who is involved, go and see that person only the day you are born so that when you shake that person, you are collecting, not you. The person taking your treasures because one, any day you are born, you have higher powers, you have higher vibration. Believe me, you are not the only one that come to this earth on that day. Your guardian angel comes. Some forces came into this earth with you, and that is one of the things that helps some of us that are spiritualists. There is something that happened. Somebody come and told me how the husband threw her away, threw the baby away, just because the baby has some abnormalities. And I, and I told her what to do. What uh, what shocked me is that she had not even done what I asked her to do. The next thing she, I now asked her how far when I saw her the next day, she said that what has never happened before over two years she born gave birth to the child and they threw her away happened that the husband used leg and come and carry the child and then that he know that he's coming to carry them that she have not even done what i, I laughed because one thing is that there, there are forces that is following us that are spiritualists goes before you to confirm whatever you tell anybody the same thing happened to another lady was complaining came to me another woman and the husband how they will work for people they would never pay them they would have been doing it to other people the mother the man who manipulate you will not even talk about that payment and so on and so forth but because they are pastors that their eyes is still there that this man has not paid them and when he will they will call for the money the man will tell them am i owing you i'm not owing you this and that they now came to me. I just told them what to do so that the man would pay them. The next day, the woman came to me and told me that shocking thing happened. That immediately they are leaving, they are leaving my office where I attended to them, that they were surprised. The next day, they have not even done what I asked them to do. The man called them, paid them, and even give them extra work. So what am I telling you? There is a spirit that follows you that forces that work with you take it or leave it that helps you to actualize your destiny that is why any day you come into this world you have upper hand if you must shake hands shake on that day but don't shake other days this your hands is highly spiritually active and powerful so that being said now get mixture maybe half a spoon one one spoon depending of cinnamon of this particular ginger powder and then grinded grinded scent leaf 
that has become powder, put it in your left palm and begin to pray, declaring your intention. And say, oh God, the creator of the universe, that I am praying that from today, that not I will not lack any good thing. This my home will not lack any good thing. That this my shop, that customers will begin to come from east to west, north and south. This my office, clients will begin to come, will get contract from time to time, and that my ogre will pay me maximum wage this time. He will no longer be paying me minimum wage. I will receive on you your favor, love, connection I have never received before. No evil is permitted in this office, is permitted in this shop, is permitted in this my home. It's only good thing. And I declare that any evil that will try to come here, let it be repelled. No money stealers, no thieves, no armed robbers is permitted in this uh, particular office, you know, in this particular shop, or in this particular home. Only good thing that I want to enter this home. Because this combination of these three give you only good thing. Cinnamon gives you money and every good thing. Then, why I have explained it in my previous video when I was talking about full moon. Why ginger helps your manifestation to come forth quickly and then Saint Leaf helps to set a kind of boundary towards your manifestation to make sure that nothing hinders it. When you have said every good thing you want to happen to that your home, your office or shop, wherever you are doing it, it will be good. If you have office, after doing it in your home, go and do it in your office. Early in the morning, you do it any day, any time, any period, it works. Then you, if you have, if it is shop you have where you sell, you go and do the same thing. Then you just stand in the main entrance, the place that connects your house to outside portal, where people, first once they are visiting your home, that is the place they will enter. And you blow it in. Believe me, that is how all the energies, the spirits and the angels that is backing this particular three item are coming into your home to begin to work. And by God's grace, you will see every good thing you have prophesied coming to pass in that your shop, in that your office, and that your home. So with this, I've actually come to the end of today's video, believing that somebody has actually found value. If you're one of those, why not give this video a thumbs up? Don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you have not done so. Hit the bell notification so as to get my next upload. Comment on this video. Share this video and share it to everyone. I'm sure I'll be helping a lot of people. As you do so, may God bless you, honor you, and cause you to ride upon the high places of this earth. See your lady Jenny saying bye-bye.